Yo, what's up everyone? This is Kremon and welcome back to another Summoner's War video. So for today, we will be doing a guild battle, but before we begin, we'll just farm some dragons. And let's head right in. Okay, I've seen a couple, actually three of them had like a Gianna defense and we'll be tackling all of it. So for the first one, we are seeing a Kakano Charlotte and a Gianna. On the other hand, Molong, Cadiz and Molly. So two very good LD net 5s and we will be bringing in this team Yeah, I'll be fitting in a Helena this time and for the bottom, I'm thinking something like a Savannah, we need a light tank as well So hopefully my Darien can tank the damage from this Cadiz Like really good, I'm not sure We'll just try it out We have no leader skill yet and we need a very good healer on our side, possibly a Riley. Although we don't have any leader skill, I think it can work because we got good armor bricks from our team and pretty good damage as well, right? Yeah, we'll try this out. Hopefully my Darien don't die like really easily. <laughs> okay, for this one, we'll try to push back the Charlotte because most of the time, it's gonna be really fast. Oh, it gets the strip. What? How did my gene get stunned up, by the way? Is this Gianna on despair? <laughs> Wait, I'm still trying to figure out things because... My gene didn't have any buff, right? Huh, very interesting. No mind, no mind. We'll use Helena Swing Flame every single time we have it. Okay, perfect. The Gianna is really low on health already. But hopefully we can sustain our Helena. Oh nice, we didn't get stunned up by the bomb. Perfect, we got the control off onto the Carcano as well. <laughs> oh my god, this Gianna on Despair, I think. Yeah, I don't think my Jin had any like buffs. So yeah, that one was quite weird. Okay, we'll just go with the gigantic roar. Perfect, we landed all the armor bricks. I'm just gonna save my skill first. Because I want to make it align with the Riley's attack buff. Okay, perfect. Now we'll place this onto the Cadiz. Huh, Molly actually cleanses herself. That's so selfish. <laughs> Usually last time, right? Molly will always cleanse the person with two debuffs. But honestly, nowadays, I have no idea what is wrong with the... Okay. That just happened. I lost I lost my words when I saw the caddies moving so many times. <laughs> now what was I talking about again? Holy shit, this caddies. Yeah, uh, but basically, previously, the Molly will always cleanse the person with two debuffs or something like that. But nowadays, yeah, it's really random. Oh my god, we have to go for the pushback. Oh, this time we don't land anything. Holy shit. I'm just afraid this Cadiz kills off my Savannah. Yo. Stop hitting my Savannah, man. We need to wait until we got the armor break before we can kill off anything really. Now that Darien is dead. Yeah, I forgot the branding with the Morlong's Reckless Assault. It's quite brutal, eh? I remember my Darien didn't really lose much life against the Cadiz procs. It was just like one Reckless Assault, GG. And we can't sustain our Savannah. Shit, we lost. Unless we can push back. Oh, we only got the Molly. Yeah, we have to go for this. Okay, we have to go for another heal. Please aim my Riley this time. Okay. Is my Savannah not on crit rate? What is going on now? I haven't seen her crit yet, by the way. Every time you use the critical link, no crit. Oh, three turns again. Nice. <laughs> I don't think we'll win. Oh, 
Okay, we'll hold on to our skills. I want to make sure that we have the attack buff before we do the gigantic roar. Yo. Yo, stop proking, dude. Getting really annoying. Come on, double big crit. Finally, man. Okay. Now the problem here is that we do not have destroy against a molly. As usual, molly toxic AF. <laughs> I seriously fucking hate this unit. Oh my god, it's so hard to deal with. If we can't let the armor break, this game is over. Come on. It all depends on Savannah, really. And whether she crit as well. Come on. I need Savannah. Double big crits. Come on. All so close. Okay, we're gonna go for the attack buff. Please crit. Oh, so, so low on health. But now the shield comes. Everything is resetted again. Come on, armor break. Oh, we had a window of opportunity earlier. Now it's gone. Yep. It's back to full life. Ah, fighting Molly is so fun. <laughs> okay, most likely I'll probably skip until we... Like managed to, to win to the end, I guess. Or maybe we just press the auto button, I'm not sure. Can we land the armor break? Okay, no clans. We still got attack buff, but I'll be putting it right now. So we got two turns in case we get an additional turn. Now we need two big crits from this critical link. Okay, it's a very nice prop, but we need to crit. Oh my god, finally! Holy shit, that was close. Okay, so we're seeing fucker, faker, okay, whatever, man. It's a Gianna Kinky Wusa. This one is also quite toxic, you know. Okay, for the bottom one, we'll try to secure the win. This one, 1000% safe. We shouldn't lose. And on the top, couple of things that I want to do here. Should we Gianna his Gianna? <laughs> this team legit should be good against this lineup because Wusa placing immunity and whatnot. The bomb's pretty good against Kinky damage as well. Yeah, we'll go with this team. I see another person using this same lineup, so when we tackle that lineup later on, we'll be using another offense, alright? So this one, I think we are just gonna try to fully focus onto the Kinky first. I want him to place the immunity as well. However, two turns sleep, man. He didn't even go for the Wish of Immortality. Holy shit, okay, wait, never mind. Kinky will wake up my Gianna later, right? Yeah, Blade Slaughter, but there was so much damage. Okay, we have to go for this. Come on, just give us stacking bombs. Perfect. And then now we go for the heal. Since the Wusa don't want to use the immunity, we are able to control them. Three bombs, I don't care. <laughs> I just want to make sure this unit is dead. It's so toxic fighting against Kinky as well. Mm hmm. I think this actually kills off the Kinky. Yeah, 27k damage. Gianna will go down as well. Okay, perfect. We'll just play some dots. Stack the bombs. Oh, we are actually landing everything this time. Yeah, that doesn't usually happen when we're fighting kinky defenses, right? Usually kinky, like, 10,000% resistance rate. Usually we can't land shit against him. <laughs> okay, looking good, looking good. Now, we'll just place the defense buff so that my Fingen and Taranis will have more damage later on. And we'll work on to the Savannah first. However, we don't really want to use the Unwanted Harmony just yet because Savannah hasn't done the Gigantic Roar. But of course, with defense buff, I'm pretty sure we shouldn't be getting armor broken by it. Mm-hmm. Okay, counter armor break. 
Oh wait. Who actually stripped my Molong though? Oh we did uh wait, my Feng Yan. We didn't use the calm mine, I see. Okay, now mine. In fact we landed the armor break, this should dismount it. No crit, still 17,000. Very good. And I'm pretty sure we should be able to tank up the damage done by them, right? Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, this should kill. Uh huh. I lost my harmony already, but we still got two more turns to revive. For some reason, my Molong taking so much damage. Holy shit! Yo, yo, yo! Don't kill my Molong. Ed, why do I keep saying Fingyan is Molong? Don't kill my Fingyan. <laughs> okay, wait. There's a few things that I can do here. Yeah, the brain not functioning yet. We'll place the revive onto Feng Yan. Very good crit. But we needed one more proc. We have to use the Calm Mine. Come on Feng Yan, can you armor break something? This Molong has the Reckless Assault soon. Actually on this turn. Okay, never mind. Very nice crit. Taranis against Molong. We shouldn't lose. We have a revive. <laughs> okay, we'll revive the Feng Yan again. So this time we got defense buff. But Feng Yan got stripped. Okay, this should kill. Ha, oh, this was so close to comfort, man. The Savannah dealt so much damage towards my Feng Yan. Okay. <laughs> So what else can we actually do against this lineup? I'm thinking like a double fire... Dark tank? Something like a Juno for the strip because there's a Wusa for immunity here. And is it possible to run a Kaki though? Haki is very good against Kinky, but I'm just afraid it dies towards the Wusa, you know? Um, but hey, we'll take the risk. Yeah, we'll bring in a Chiana for some protection here. And then we can run the defense lead. Okay, on the bottom, I want to play with my Fat Cat with Josephine. Where is my Berman? And then we fit in a Abelio. Okay, let's go. First fight will be very interesting. So we got no will on our side. That's perfect. Now we go for the heal. Kaki actually faster than my Juno, but it's fine. Now we go for the strip. Oh, okay. Let's try to kill off the Gianna first, actually. Oh, but we got the sleep though. Hmm. Yeah, we'll work onto the Wusa then. <laughs> okay, looking good. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Do we actually cleanse this? No, 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 no. I think Gianna still has the, the skill, right? Critical error. I'm not sure whether he actually did the third skill yet. Okay, now he goes for the strip. My Kaki stun up and we'll be able to heal him up. This team looks pretty legit though against this lineup. Because now we have very good unit to deal against the Kinky, right? Okay, we are taking so much damage. Blade Slaughter. I need the third skill. Oh, we don't have a cleanse. But big damage though. Yeah, this should kill. Perfect! We want all the Giannas! <laughs> okay, now, like I said, whenever he goes for the Reckless Assault, we'll be able to heal up. And then, I guess we try to focus onto the Vigor. Yeah, we'll go for the Strip. Nice counter stun. 
problem here is that we do not have any armor breaks on my team. So it might take quite a while to deal against this Vigor, right? But we got no choice because Vigor is gonna be doing so much uh, damage with his armor break turret skill and also healing the team, speed buff, all those kind of stuff. I don't really like it. Holy shit, we're taking so much damage! The Perna crit my Josephine! And then now we can't heal! Oh my god, another crit! You've gotta be shitting me, man! Holy shit, we lost! Unless we can kill off the Perna, then... Even then, I'm not sure whether we can actually win, you know? <sighs> what do we do? We try stun? Okay. Reckless Assault again, and he has the heal up. Oh, the 3 turns armor break, GG man. The Perna is gonna crit my ass. Oh no. <laughs> Yo, I'm so unlucky. I was like looking forward to using this lineup as well. And our Josephine just got wrecked. Yeah, GG man. Nice. Good game, good game. <laughs> A little bit unfortunate with this one. But hey, we'll come back stronger, right? If you do enjoy this video, please make sure to hit the thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing as it helps out the channel a ton. Thank you very much for all the support and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care, stay safe, peace out.